What's up, everybody? We're back again for a quick industry update uh, on the financial side, especially when it relates to uh, interest rates, and mortgages, and a little bit of advice on whether or not is a good time, not a good time to buy, and what should we should be seeing uh, here in the near future. Um, we've had an interesting couple of weeks uh, in the last, you know, few weeks, right, Abiel? And, Absolutely. Uh, yeah, it's been a little bit crazy. And even though the jobs report came out last week and everybody was almost in a little bit of a panic because it, it didn't meet expectations, um, we've seen a little bit, a slight change. Um, so why don't we start there and then talk through what we're expecting to see over the next two to three, maybe four weeks in the market. Absolutely. So, yeah, we had a, a big uh, short uh, coming when it came to the job reports last week. Uh, then, and that triggered a almost like a panic in the market. Uh, so everybody started screaming recession or this and that, whatever. But the, this year they had this week, we had a little bit of an uptick to show that it was a little bit of an overcorrection when it came to the uh, unemployment rate. So uh, the mortgage rates did drop last week. Uh, they are still holding steady at that lower price. Uh, but the other big thing in our industry is that the 10 year treasury uh, did drop below 4% for the first time in a while, and it has stayed there. Um, so that has all, in, all but indicating that now coming in September, uh, during the uh, September 18 meeting, there's going to be at least a 50 basis point cut, which means about a uh, half a percent on the current rate. And then just a snowball effect after that uh, for continuing job cuts so that be able to uh, manage the uh, slowdown of jobs and the uh, treasury dropping as well. Well, that's good. So people that are thinking about buying a home, I'm still going to say that now is a good time to be thinking about it. If, if you're on the fence and um, you know, you're waiting for interest rates to drop. Now's the time to do it because if we see a lower, uh, a, a bigger drop here in the next uh, few weeks, it's my opinion and, and purely my opinion that the market's going to go a little bit crazy again. Absolutely. Uh, every expert is right now saying if you're on the fence about buying that first home or upgrading the current one, it is the time to do it. Once the rates start dropping, it is too late. Everybody's going to be off the fence and off the sidelines at that point. And then that's when we're going to get back into multiple offers on houses. Uh, now is the time to get the house at the best price possible. And like we talked about last week during our podcast, we can always refinance the house later at a much lower rate. But now is the time to get off the fence and get going and get put that plan together. You know, give us a call. Let us know what you're thinking, what you're hoping. We'll help you out with uh, being able to put the best plan together for you uh, so that we can get to that house. Awesome. So I'll leave our details down below. If you're looking to purchase a house, if you just want to talk about a future plan, um, your current circumstance, we're happy to do that as well. Comment below. Let us know what you're thinking. And uh, we'll reach back out to you guys next week with a new update. Happy Friday. Happy Friday.